I, I think if we pull back a little and we can, you know, look at the story of voting in America uh, from the founding until today, uh, it's an arc that begins with exclusion and slowly leads to inclusion. Um, obviously, at the founding, uh, virtually no one could vote, you know, only uh, property owning white males. So even though we have these grand ideals of equality and representative democracy, we don't actually operate in that way. And slowly over the course of history, those democratic ideals have won out time and again from the removal of property qualifications, the enfranchisement of blacks, the enfranchisement of women, and the arguments in favor of equality have always won the day or almost always won the day in the end. You know, the moment that pandemic hit in this country, I think it just seemed like the most obvious thing in the world to say, oh, of course we need to make voting by mail as broadly accessible as possible.